Let's learn dates and calendars part 3 today. Let's see the four steps which are important for using the previous methods we learned before. Step 1. Take the last two digits in the year. If the year is 1942, take the last digits 4, 2 as the last digits. Step 2. Add the number of leap years from 1901. Step 3. Add the date and the month key, the key which we learned in the previous video. Step 4. Divide the total by 7 and verify it with the day key. Let's see a solved example to understand this concept and this 4 steps better. What day is 1 January 1941? Let's see with the example. As for the first step, we take the last two digits. So the last two digits in the year 1941 were 41. So we have taken 41. We add it to the number of leap years from 1901 to 1941. So the number of leap years between these two years were 10. So we add them. That is 41 plus 10. Next, we add the month key to January that is 1 January's place in the month key is 1 so we add it to the addition of the two numbers before and then we add the date that is again 1 so we get a complete total as 53 so as for now the next step when we divide 53 by 7 we get the quotient as 7 and the remainder as 4 however we are most concerned with the remainder only from the day key it can be seen that the remainder 4 corresponds with Wednesday as we learned 1 corresponds with Sunday, 2 with Monday and so on. So by that key 4 corresponds with Wednesday. Hence we know that 1st January 1941 was Wednesday. Try this trick with many dates till the year 2000 and tell me if this trick really worked for you. Thank you. So did you find this video helpful? Solve this kind of sums and share this video with all your friends. Do comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe our channel and also turn on the bell icon. Bye bye.